Unidentified miscreants on Tuesday, November 21st held two crude bombs at the Shodohanpa House of BNP Standing Committee member Mirza Abbas, who has been staying in jail since his arrest on October 31st. The security personnel of the house said two criminals came on a motorcycle around 7.50 am on and hurriedly fled after throwing the two crude bombs outside the house. They also said one of the crude bombs was denoted and the other remained unexploded. Later, the police came to the spot and recovered the unexploded crude bomb. Abba's wife, Afrizar Abbas, alleged that two cadres of the ruling party wearing helmets carried out the attack. Talking to reporters at her house, she said, I phoned the security guard hearing a loud explosion. He said two men wearing black clothes and helmets made the attack. They were on the same motorcycle. Afrizar. The president of Jatiyata Badi Mohiladal alleged that there were three members of the police outside the house during the crude bomb explosion. The police were requested to detain the miscreants. The police did not do that as they helped miscreants to escape. She alleged that criminals were repeatedly attacking their house and pelting brickbats at the house, leaving the family members in a scary situation. Abba's wife said police members told her that the activists of BNP student and youth wings were carrying out the attacks. I am suffering from insecurity. I want justice. The ale carders are making the attacks and shifting the blame on the opposition. We want relief from this, Afrizar said. He alleged that the law enforcers were pampering the ruling party men to attack her house repeatedly. The boys who did it with the help of the administration must belong to the ruling. But they won't be brought under trial. Mirza Abbas was arrested on October 31st in a case filed under the sabotage and explosives laws in connection with violence entering BNP's October 28th rally. Report by staff correspondent Dhaka. Johnson David Voice 7 News.